please subscribe our channel, My World, before watching the video. Thank you so much. Let's start. Bruce Lee, born Lee Jun Fan on November 27, 1940, in San Francisco, California, was a legendary martial artist, actor, director, and philosopher who became an icon of martial arts cinema and popular culture. He is widely regarded as one of the most influential martial artists of all time and played a crucial role in popularizing martial arts around the world. Bruce Lee's journey into martial arts began at a young age. He started training in traditional Chinese martial arts, including Wing Chun, under the guidance of his master, Yip Man, in Hong Kong. Over time, Lee developed a deep passion for martial arts and dedicated his life to its pursuit and mastery. In the 1960s, Bruce Lee moved back to the United States and began teaching martial arts to a diverse range of students, including Hollywood celebrities and professional athletes. His teachings went beyond physical techniques, encompassing a philosophy that emphasized adaptability, efficiency, and an open-minded approach to learning. This philosophy would later become the foundation of his own martial art philosophy, Jeet Kune Do, or, The Way of the Intercepting Fist. Lee's big break in Hollywood came when he was cast as Kato, the sidekick of the Green Hornet, in the TV series, The Green Hornet, in the 1960s. Though the series only lasted one season, it introduced Bruce Lee to a broader audience and paved the way for his future success. In the early 1970s, Bruce Lee achieved international fame with his iconic roles in martial arts films such as The Big Boss, Fist of Fury, Way of the Dragon, also known as Return of the Dragon, and his most famous film, Enter the Dragon. Enter the Dragon was the first martial arts film produced by a major Hollywood studio and became a massive success, solidifying Lee's status as a global superstar. What set Bruce Lee apart from other martial arts actors of his time was his unparalleled skill, speed, and charisma on screen. He brought a new level of realism and authenticity to fight scenes, discarding theatricality in favor of practical and effective techniques. Lee's lightning-fast strikes, fluid movements, and his philosophy of using no way as the way captivated audiences worldwide and left an indelible mark on the martial arts film genre. Tragically, Bruce Lee's life was cut short on July 20, 1973, at the young age of 32. He died in Hong Kong under mysterious circumstances, and the exact cause of his death remains the subject of debate and speculation. However, his untimely passing only added to the legend of Bruce Lee and fueled the fascination with his life and legacy. Even after his death, Bruce Lee's influence continued to grow. He inspired generations of martial artists, actors, and athletes and remains an enduring symbol of discipline, determination, and the pursuit of excellence. Lee's philosophies on martial arts and life continue to be studied and followed by enthusiasts and practitioners worldwide. His impact on popular culture and the martial arts world is immeasurable, ensuring that his legacy will live on for generations to come.